What's going on everybody? I'm Zach Ortman. For those of you who don't know, uh, today we are going to be taking a look at the Sony Alpha 6000 paired with the Sony Stereo Microphone ECM XY ST1M. Crazy name. Don't know why anybody would use a name like that, but hey, it works. Uh, compared to the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra uh, with paired with the Galaxy Buds Live. So obviously camera, mirrorless DSLR, smartphone with wireless earbuds uh, compared to a hardwired mic to a camera, uh, two totally different classes of tech, two totally uh, different devices. Uh, the Sony Alpha 6000 is of course a few years older than the Note 20 Ultra, but anyway, we're going to check them both out. Well, let's go take a look. or so here. Uh, figured I'd do some filming about what I use to film. Um, the, the camera that I use uh, or the smartphone uh, and the microphone that I use on the camera. Compare them. Uh, see what kind of quality comes out of the both of them. See what you guys think. <clears throat> I think that it's really neat that we've come to a point in this day and age that we can just record on our smartphones. Uh, it's it's pretty it's pretty neat to think that you know a lot of people on YouTube, especially in social media and all these different places, when they film, they're filming with their smartphones. So I figured let's do a comparison. Out here we've got something beaten down here on the snow. Uh, got quite a bit of contrast between the woods uh, and the snow on the ground. And some of the dead branches and. I don't know if there's any dead leaves still hanging anywhere, but just test it out, test the mic on this camera because I haven't really gotten a chance to test it very much yet. Uh, I'll link it below so you guys can check that out. It's a really good price for the for the uh, mic that you get. Uh, see how it goes. of the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. Uh, the video is being pulled from, of course, the phone. The audio is being pulled from the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live. When I pre-ordered the Note 20, they had a $200 credit deal, get the Galaxy Buds Live, so that's what I used it for. And it has this great feature in the camera app for Pro Video where you can adjust which microphones you're using to record audio. And this is one of the options. Uh, I actually haven't listened to anything that I've recorded via the uh, buds, but be interesting to see how it sounds and how it compares to the Sony Alpha 6000 with that Sony mic attached to it. Uh, I bought that specific mic because it has phenomenal reviews 
uh, for the quality you get with the price. I guess we're going to find out how it compares to the Galaxy Buds Live recording to the Pro Video. Samsung is notorious for putting out really saturated, contrasty, high quality video from their smartphones. They've been doing it for years. And I've been a Samsung guy for a lot of years now. And this will be interesting just to see in this type of uh, scenario where we've got all the snow uh, and the dark trees and the shadows all over the place because of the, the, where the sun's coming from, how it picks up me uh, and obviously the sound from the, the buds once again. But give you a look at these headphones just to see where they're at. I don't know if you can see them or not in my ears, but the uh, the quality is supposed to be pretty decent for you know recording from a wireless earbud. So on top of the videos, here's some still images that I took on both devices. Of course, naturally, my eye seems to be more drawn towards the Galaxy Note 20 images. Personally, I think that's just from the more punchiness of the color, uh, the more saturation that Samsung produces out of their cameras. You've just got a um, brighter, more saturated image, I think, from them. But of course, you have a more realistic, more uh, overall quality picture, I think, from the Alpha 6000. Uh, the the Samsung's taking in a 4 by 3 ratio, whereas the the Alpha 6000 is taking a 16 by 9 ratio image. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope that you guys stay tuned for some more videos. I feel terrible I didn't post anything after my first initial introduction video. Uh, a lot of that was due to my wife and I both contracting COVID-19, unfortunately. Uh, we were both pretty run down, uh, pretty beat up from it for a few days. Uh, and I know it's been a few weeks since that, that initial video. But thank you guys for coming back, for watching. Uh, hope you guys continue to come back. Of course, if you want to see more videos and follow my family and I on this journey, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and of course hit that bell to get notified when more videos hit the channel. Uh, we are going to be posting videos at least once a week from this point on. Uh, I would do work a full-time job, uh, so I'm doing this on the side, of course. And I want to, you know, try and build this into a business, try and build this into something that I can do that I love, something that I get to do with my family all the time. And if you hear things running around, it's rabbits over here. Uh, so I'm going to be posting some things uh, over the next few weeks. Uh, vlogs, hunting videos, just family videos of my wife and son and hopefully of my other family too. We're just coming towards the end of our quarantine after having COVID. Uh, has not been fun. Uh, it's been pretty, pretty draining. So stay tuned, check out the videos that we're going to have coming up and click on the links below to check out my Instagram and my Twitter. Uh, not much up on Twitter yet, but lots to go through on Instagram. Uh, check out those check out me on, on all those social media sites and you will also see uh, some links for some of the products used in these videos uh, the mic the camera the phone and the galaxy buds live so i will see you guys in the next one